this is Daughter of Christ and Jay, Peace of Christ be to everyone watching. Um, we were made aware of a video that was on Facebook, um, which was quite popular, about the recent uh, events regarding uh, the cartoons in France and also um, the um, people in um, Europe and other places who are speaking out against um, their prophet Muhammad. And uh, we just wanted to share with you. So um, my brother Jay here, he put, sorry, go on brother. You wanna speak about what you found on Facebook? Yeah, um, thank you daughter for having me with you and uh, peace of Christ with you all. Um, as daughter said, we just wanna show you guys this uh, this nasheed that, that was brought to our attention. Um, you can see here on the Facebook page, it says there are 6.7 million views and it's only about two weeks old. Um, there's around 200,000 shares and then there's about 8.5k 8. 8. comments. Um, so we just wanted to show how popular this is and how widespread it is. Um, in the, this is, I guess you could say it's in the Arab world because it's all in Arabic. But what we did was we put together a translation to show you guys what this nasheed is saying and you know, basically what they're trying to get Muslims to do. Go ahead, daughter. And if you, you can see the hashtag here, it's in Arabic, hashtag Muhammad, hashtag Khat Ahmar or red line at the bottom. So this has become a quite, quite a popular hashtag uh, for people who want to defend the Prophet. And um, like my brother says, it's, it's, it's all in Arabic. Um, Nasheed, by the way, for non-Arab speakers, it's like a, it's a song that has, um, I guess, it's been used for Islamic songs, Muslim songs. So this, the man who's written this, he's known for making these nasheeds that are to do with Muslim themes. Go on, brother. Just wanted to yeah, I just wanted to show um, a little bit of uh, his other other songs that he writes or nasheeds, um, and you can see just from the just from the imagery alone. Um, I, I guess you can kind of get an image of like you see this guy here with the rifle in his hand. This guy. I don't know if you can see my mouse or not, but this guy has like a vest on, like a soldier. He's just, a, we just want to show to you guys that this guy is like a proper jihadi, the, the one who wrote the lyrics for this song and he's singing it and probably produced it. And then whoever put it together, um, we'll see, uh, you guys will see some, especially why we're sharing it with you. But yeah, this is just a couple of uh, his other nasheeds. I'm just scrolling through the YouTube. You can see, um, just from the imagery and the photos, like who this guy is, gives you a really clear image, I think. Yeah, and all we did was put his name, Muhammad Nawahda, uh, in the YouTube search, and this is what we found. So um, just so you know, from the results of Facebook, it's even though he looks quite militant, he has 6.7 million views and lots of thousands and hundreds of thousands of shares and likes. So this is you know, pretty widespread now. So, uh, brother, are you happy to um, play the video and we'll stop at certain points and comment? Yeah, so let's let's get right into the nasheed now um, and uh, uh, we'll, we'll just play it out. Um, there are a couple of points we want to stop at, but I think they do a really good job emphasizing the points they're trying to make, but we'll still comment on some of the things and uh, if at any point you want me to stop, just let me know. Um, but yeah, I'll get started now. Muhammad Khattun Rahmar Walahu Junoodun Tazwar Isma Ya Kulli Al-Alam Deen Muhammad Lalan Yukhar Muhammad Khattun Rahmar Walahu Junoodun Tazwar Isma Ya Kulli Al-Alam Deen Muhammad So as you can see our sister Hatun here um, daughter if you, if you want to comment you can see this is the her talking with Yahya and they're about to get, or she's about to get attacked uh, by this violent uh, jihadi guy. And right in the lyrics of the song, he, he's saying that there are soldiers who are basically going to rise up and they're going to, you know, defend Muhammad's honor. And that's the imagery that they're trying to show. Like, you guys, you, you, you guys who are, who are insulting, and he's going to get into more detail throughout the song. 
but he, and he's going to you know define what he means more but basically he's saying those who speak out against islam um you, we want you to know that muhammad is a red line and and you guys are crossing that line and he has soldiers people who are ready to fight for him and this is what we're going to do and then they show the scene here where she gets attacked uh go ahead daughter yes exactly i couldn't have said it better really um so this is the most disturbing part of the song for me because it's showing our sister twin being attacked as the lyrics are playing and it's quite an upbeat um you know uh, rhythm about having soldiers that will rise up stand up and defend the prophet um right at, uh, playing in the background while our sister is being hit as an example of the action that should be done uh it's very disturbing go on bro yeah so so we'll just let the video play out i think there is one other part that we wanted to pause on just to give some comments on uh, but we'll just let it play out for you guys I'll actually since this is only 12 seconds and i'll just play it from the beginning and we'll just pause it that one last part and you guys can see uh what's going on here and and uh through this translation so here we go i'll, I'll play it right now <laughs> اسمع يا كل العالم دين محمد لا لن يقهر محمد خط واحمر وله جنود تضمر اسمع يا كل العالم دين محمد لا لن يقهر الا رسول الله الا رسول الله الا رسول الله الا رسول الله سحقا للسانك يقسى مقرون وتقسى فرنسا فمحمد أظهر منكم إياك لأصلك تنسى سحقا للسانك يقسى مقرون وتقسى فرنسا فمحمد أظهر منكم إياك لأصلك تنسى إلا رسول الله إلا رسول الله محمد قسم وعظم نبديه بالغرواح كل الدنيا فلتعلم اكتب سجلها وافهم محمد قسم وعظم نبديه بالغرواح كل الدنيا فلتعلم إلا رسول الله إلا رسول الله Okay, uh, I just wanted to go back to one part, um, just to we, we get some clarification on for those who might not know. Um, right here, when the lyrics are set, the lyrics say, "Oh, those who love Taha, this is our prophet. Get up, calling them as you know, call to action." Um, daughter, if you could just explain to uh, the viewers who may not know what what's being referred to here, what's Taha? Uh, Taha is another name for Muhammad. 
uh, it's the start of Surah 20. It says, Taha, we have not revealed uh, the Quran to you, so you struggle. So um, he's basically calling Muhammad by one of his names, beloved names that Muslims know. So he's saying, yeah, go on, bro. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, because some, some people might not know that. Um, Muhammad actually has many names in Islam. This is one of them. But really, I mean, this whole, the whole video now, just going back to the Nishida, the whole, the whole thing, like what, what the image, the imagery they're trying to express, going back to, you know, what, like our sister Hatun here, and what they're doing in this video and and you can see the signs that they're holding up some sometimes they're in arabic sometimes they're in french sometimes they're uh, in english one of the signs says uh, something to the effect of insulting our prophet or insulting islam is not freedom of speech something to that effect you can see one of the signs in the video people are holding up and so this is really a call to action that Muslims are, are, are doing, uh, spreading this um, so far, on, they're, they're doing a really good job spreading it on social media, like, what was it, to, to, um, you know, it's getting near, getting near to 7 million views on Facebook alone, this, this video, this video that we're showing right now, we're just showing a translation, we added the translation, we did the translation, but the original video on Facebook has almost 7 million views, and so it's being spread, and it's 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 a call to action to 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 not just um silence though well it is a way to silence but but a call to violence as well so it's not just telling people hey stop insulting islam but it's calling muslims to violently oppress people who are who are uh, coming out against islam and they're using what happened to our sister hatun here as an example something that's acceptable and these are what the soldiers of islam should be doing Yeah, it's quite dangerous, really, because uh, it's showing the pictures that they were showing of all the crowds. Uh, they are demonstrations of thousands of people all over the Islamic world uh, about against the criticism of Muhammad in, um, like, in the press, in the free press in uh, in the West. Uh, and it's basically a show of strength, a show of numbers, saying. And one of the lyrics was saying, "Listen, all you whole world." the army of Muhammad is not going to be beaten. So there is, it's, a, it's a very uh, dangerous Im imagery of the whole world against the army of Muhammad, which is basically what Islam is all about. We know that from the teachings of Muhammad. And um, yeah, go on. Sorry, Jay. Yeah, no, yeah, I, I, I agree with you 100%. Like this is just expressing the teachings of Muhammad, the teachings of Islam, and they're just basically summing it up right now in, into a video for us. And they're showing us like I'll, I'll put it on mute and I'll just let the video play out as we're talking on, on mute though. So we can still talk. You, you can see um, they're, they have demonstrations like thousands, hundreds and hundreds of some, sometimes thousands of Muslims coming together. And th this is, this is what Islam is. You know, this is what Islam is, is encouraging them to do. Uh, so you can see the signs there. In fact, that's a really funny sign. Let me just, just go back to that real quick. So that said, um, the the prophet the the prophet um, is the savior of humanity, um, and then it says mercy. I think it says for for man, uh, you know it says for mankind. I think underneath there. So so this is their idea of mercy, um, daughter, to to do what they did to our sister Hatun. That 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 is the 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 savior of humanity. That's the mercy for mankind. What do you think about that? I think people ought to take it seriously when Sister Hatun says this is a dangerous ideology. This is what we're, uh, we're talking about here. Uh, this call to action, these not all these angry mobs, these big numbers with the lyrics, beating lyrics uh, behind them saying, uh, you be damned, uh, you know, Muhammad is purer than you. Uh, don't forget that we, we will rise up, we will get up, we will defend. Uh, and as you can see in the, some of the pictures, uh, they're, they're, they're pushing through the barriers, they're pushing through um, the police. These ang just, it just, and it tugs on the, the emotions of Muslims that we love him, we'll do anything for him, we'll give our souls for him. It's war, basically. And war, why? Because people dare to criticize and use free speech in the West, not even in their own countries. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, like... You know they're, they're they're demanding that everybody understands them what the entire world to know that they're willing to give up their entire lives just to defend his honor 
And what that means is don't critique him. It's not it's not that it's not that they're saying you guys are going out and killing us and you guys are starting a war with us physically. They're just saying you guys are critiquing Muhammad. You, you know, you're putting holes in the Quran or you're 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 showing pictures of Muhammad. That that we're willing to give our lives to, to stop that. So I don't I know we don't want to go too long. We we just hit over fifteen minutes. So um any any closing words, um sister? I think it's important for us to know what the Arab world is saying. And this is an example. Uh, like you said, brother, this is now almost 7 million views. So this is a very palpable thing that is happening in the Arab world whenever Muhammad is critiqued. And uh, it's a very sad thing. We want people to know what's happening and um, what it looks like to the rest of the world, this, this madness. And uh, I just want people to pray, even for all these people gathered, uh, willing to die, willing to wage war for this man. That's why I want to say that. Yeah, definitely pray for these people. Pray for these Muslims that they be re released from the chains of Islam, from the chains of Satan. They're serving Muhammad. They're serving Satan. And they think that they're doing something for God, but they're actually doing it for the devil. We just pray for their salvation, Lord, that you grant them repentance. That they come to you and pray. Amen. And this is the spirit of Islam for people who don't know. This is what it looks like. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Um, we're going to close out now. God bless you all, and take care.